The big question was, is religion good or bad for humanity? And I know it's a very big question for three minutes to answer. But I don't want to leave this auditorium without having the chance to listen to your opinion. So we will begin with you. Three minutes. Is religion good or bad? It's neither and it's both. Religion, like any institution, has succumbed to cronyism, power mongering, influence peddling, corruption, bureaucracy, and all the things that happen with organizing any activity. Is it good? Well, people have had religious experiences throughout the ages, which include transcendence, epistemological humility, reverence, gratitude, uh, the feeling and emergence of platonic qualities like truth, goodness, beauty, harmony, understanding that there is evolution in the universe. These are, I think, religious experiences, and they have been there throughout history. There is also, through religious experience, a shift in identity from personal identity to a broader identity that allows those people who have that experience to overcome their fear of death, to lose their fear of death. And there is again, what I said, this deep humility and gratitude and reverence for the mystery of our existence. That's the religious experience. Now, of course, it can be corrupted and people go to war and kill each other and do all kinds of abysmal things in the name of God and the name of religion. But that doesn't mean that the religious experience itself is invalid. Uh, does science have good or bad aspects to it? A fragmented science in the absence of evolutionary uh, changes in our spirit or consciousness creates the technologies I mentioned. You know, mechanized death, uh, global warming, climate change, extinction of species, extinction, uh, risking our own extinction. So I believe that we do need a broader science that accommodates spirituality, the spiritual experience, so we use what we know from science wisely so that we can make the best use of scientific technologies. But I do say that science will never give us the answer into the meaning of our existence, into why there is a universe, why there is consciousness. Only consciousness can experience consciousness. That's why we need spirituality. If by spirituality, I mean self-awareness, self-reflection, transcendence, and our own desire to know ourselves. In my view, our search for God is our highest instinct to know ourselves, to find meaning in our own lives, to understand why there is evolution, what is the purpose of existence? Thank you very much. Time is over.